right. As always, let's play this in full. We will risk our lives, blah, blah, blah. Okay, done. I did my part. Cool. Part. This is extremely picky, and I should never start a review with this, <laughs> but you can probably um, turn this around so that it has like a full... You make a really messy turn so that you have the full shape of the cap so you can really see it. Again, we should not concentrate on this right now, but it's like a, it's such a quick thing. I just wanted to mention there. Other than that, let's see. We will risk our lives, blah. We will risk our lives. I think you're totally fine to get into spline. I mean, there's some moments where I would uh, accentuate a bit more. For instance, when she says lines. We will risk our lives. Uh, lives, sorry. We will risk our lives. So we will risk our lives like on lives. I would raise the head a bit. Just to, it's a, it's it's such a moment in the audio. We will risk our lives. Risk our lives, but you know it's still stepped and blocky. So I would spline this out and then start working on those finer details. We will risk our lives. Blah blah blah. Okay. But I do love this here. I love that. Now that raise. I like that little detail with the leg coming forward there. Blah blah blah. Again, extreme detail, but I wonder if on that rotation I would bring out that. It would be tricky because then you would be countering that finger, but you might, because you're raising and blah, 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 that you might even maybe raise a pinky there and straighten this finger a bit just for a little detail thing. And then you come back to a more tenser pose the way you have it here. Again, I should be focusing on, on the broader things, but since I'm seeing it, I'm mentioning it now. Risk our lives, blah, blah, blah. Lives, blah. That being said, and I'm seeing it here, so this might be too much of a of a mirroring, uh, turning thing. So maybe it would just be something in in the just consider something in here. But I like that you have it here, so I might take that back out there. Lives, blah blah blah. Okay, done. I did my part. Okay, done. The only thing I would say is when you go back here. Okay. Again, it might just be then once you spline it, but I feel like done on the done, you do have a settle done, but I think you can at this point just bring that shoulder down to here a bit lower so that on done, you have a, a, just a bigger lean. So imagine that done. I did my part. Yeah, but then you have it on. I did my part. Blah. Okay. Done. I did my part. Okay. How about this? I will probably do this since you have it already here and you push it. I will probably when you if you push it this far, have a little bit more on the root to the left. But the only thing I would do here on done, as she goes done, imagine you're bringing your root down like a like a button height, so that she's still slightly elevated. Then done, and it has a bit more of, a, of an accent of the body going down, and then boom, when she does this, it's more of a move over this way. Did my part. But well, that is totally doable. So, you know, in spline mode, I think you're totally fine now. We will risk our lives. We will risk our lives, blah, blah, blah. The only things you will have to look at as you spline is that when you do something like this, if you spline this out, this feels like it's one ginormous unit turning. There's no separation between, you know, any of the bigger body parts. So just consider that as you start splining, how you're going to get into this turn. You know, this basically feels like it's just one like main control of turning the whole thing. But the rest here definitely broken up and nice. We will risk our lives, blah, blah, blah. Okay, done. I did my part. Done. I did my part. Okay, done. I did my part. Uh, okay, done. I did my part. I wonder if here on this, but this here, that's your big attitude moment there. Done. I did my part. I wonder if you could experiment with pulling the head forward. Just something to spice this up by like 10%. Something where it's a little bit, a little bit of something. I was going to say maybe a bigger rotation, but you have a pretty big rotation here. And I wanted to, I don't want to repeat that, but something to experiment as you spline, you can for yourself, you can try it out. If she, if she says this, you know, could that be something? If you move your neck forward, how would that feel? So just as a thought. We will risk our lives, blah, blah, blah. Okay, done. I did my part. So 
Same thing here at the end. When she gets, she has the attitude of popping it up. That's great. Then she's ready to drink. And I know this is at the very end, but this is just the arm going up. And I wonder, could that be with the head more relaxed back? Would she bring up her head a bit more? I'm not sure that she would go forward to drink. Um, that's the only thing since that's the last move. So it's not just a mechanics of the arm and, and bottle up. Is there something where, where we can have this? Is this attitude, can we push this attitude here? Is there something else where, you know, if she had relaxed eyes, this could just be, I'm thinking about something. Now, of course, this gives us a, a different mood, but is there something else that we can do when she goes from here all the way to here? Is there something we can do with a twist in the head or just a turn or or something where we can kind of continue that that this attitude here just a thought um, i know it's at the very end it might not matter once we spline it out and and we realize that it just it just cuts out you might also have to add frames because again this is a big move over one frame so once you spline this you might feel like oh we're just barely getting into into this and again you might need 10 or 20 frames um to make the timing work on this since again this is that's one of the pitfalls of stepped i think this is it's a very quick move that we might can't fit in this short time frame. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'm going to leave this here. I would say go, 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 Spline. It's awesome. And I'm looking forward to the next version. Thank you. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.